Hi, I'm Shannon LaJudis. And I'm Christina McFall. And this is your F3 update. So we've got a lot going on this month. It's officially fall. We've got the Professional Women's Council Women Connecting Women event on October 18th. It's the first event. They're going to be having an award ceremony, a sit-down dinner, and a great opportunity to network with other women in Jacksonville. We also have our upcoming PS27 Leadership Week. Um, we hope that you guys can join us for the finale that takes place on November 1st. The keynote speaker is going to be Anthony Jabor, yep. the CEO of Black Knights, so that's an event you won't want to miss. You're also going to have an opportunity to network with all of the teams who have gone through leadership training. Yes, and also in November we are um, going to the Women Empowerment Expo, um, which most of you may know is brought on by Alexa Carlin. Um, PS27 is actually hosting a pitch competition there. That's going to be in Fort Lauderdale on November 10th. It's a Saturday. You're not going to want to miss it. It's going to be a huge event. We're really excited about it. And of course, many of you had the opportunity to meet Alexa during mm -hmm. last year's Female Founders Forum. So another opportunity to support her and go to that event. All right, so we've got some news for you guys. Seen and heard in the community. Uh, Blended Designs, one of the PS27 companies, was recently invited out to LA. I went out with the Blended Designs team and we were able to give goodie bags to Emmy nominees at a gifting event. It was a great time. We got to network with a lot of people. You might have also seen them on Action News Jax recently. Um, so big things happening in the community for Blended Designs. Another thing I want to mention is um, recently we had our female founders meet up in September. Um, a couple of ladies came through to Cooper's Hawk and we were talking about um, Erica Bridges' daughter, Simone. Um, she recently just came out with a book called The Science Behind It um, with other young entrepreneurs, so that was very exciting. You might also know her as the Goddess Food Factory. Yeah. She came out to F3 last year, so many of you might have gotten a chance to meet her, but definitely reach out, congratulate her on the book. Um, so we've got a lot of really exciting things going on in the community. If you want to learn more about uh, F3, the Female Founders Forum, or how to get involved with female entrepreneurs, yeah. feel free to reach us at ps27ventures.com, or you can reach out to Shannon or myself individually. Yeah, and we hope to get some updates from you guys so we could share it in the next update. Have a great October, and we will catch back up next season. Bye! Bye. We also have a clip um, for female entrepreneurs that we wanted to share with you. It's going to be right after this. Tell and sell your story using the words that are consistent with what the buyer is buying. I went to this college because I wanted to focus more on my analytical and my quantitative skills. I ran for president of the student body because I knew I had strong relationship building skills and I wanted to enhance my organizational skills. So no matter what it is, tell and sell your story using the words that the buyer is really buying. I'm Carla Harris, and I'll see you next time on Daily Hustle.